Hey guys, this is Todd Hazleton with Techno Buffalo. I'm here in the NVIDIA booth, and what you're looking at is basically just a white box design of the Tegra 4i chip. You can see the amazing gaming performance already. Now this gives me two questions. Is NVIDIA going to build its own phone? It certainly has the ability to. We're looking at it right here. And two, you know, how soon are we going to see these Tegra 4i chips? We already know that ZTE is going to launch them later this year, but when they have a design like this, Basically, they're laying out all the parts and everything that somebody needs to do in order to build the phone. It sort of encourages a manufacturer to use a Tegra 4i as opposed to Qualcomm or something like that. And especially when you get these kind of amazing graphics. With, uh, hopefully, they're coming through on the video for you. In any case, I think my biggest question is, are we going to see a smartphone from NVIDIA? And what we're seeing here is a total possibility that, yes, it could happen. And it seems like it would happen in the way sort of like HTC did things where they used to build devices uh, for other companies. And here, it's coming from a different angle. They build processes for other companies, but they certainly have the ability to build phones, too. So quick look, we can't get inside, but you can see it. Even despite the power, the phone's relatively thin. Got the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack up there, the volume buttons on the top. Anyway, quick look here at this sample design of the Tegra 4i chip uh, at the NVIDIA booth, Mobile World Congress, and this is Todd Hazel.